watching the DSM Broadcasting Network. Welcome to the Abiding Word Broadcast. Welcome and thank you for joining us for today's Abiding Word program. I'm so happy that you decided to be with us today. You're going to be blessed by our anointed music, plus encouraged and edified by the preaching and teaching of the Word of God. And at the end of the program, we're going to be praying a prayer of faith just for you. So stay right there. We're going to get started right after this. Hello, this is Evangelist Dudley Smith. If you like studying the Word of God like I do, praise God, you're going to want to get this book from our ministry, Basic Bible Knowledge, New Testament. It was a joy putting this together, praise the name of Jesus, and uh, it, it, it's helped me in my study, my preaching, and presentation of the Word of God, and just a chock full of information. Glory to God. I want you to go to our website now and order your copy. It's a hardback, hard, hardback, perfect bound book, praise God, that you can put in your library. Keep it by your desk as you study the Word of God. That's Bible Basic Knowledge, New Testament. Glory to God. Get this and enrich the Word of God in your life. I know you'll be glad you did. <music> Oh, 
bless the name of Jesus, the Lord God. Hello, this is Evangelist Dudley Smith. and so glad that you're with us today for this edition of the Abiding Word broadcast. We are in a very, very, very interesting and very, to me, fulfilling subject matter. And, and that subject matter is the value of righteousness or living a righteous lifestyle. Praise the name of God. Did you know that righteousness brings value to your life? It brings value to your life. Hallelujah to God. It brings you to a place of happiness and joy. Glory to God. Peace that passes all understanding. Hallelujah to God. To know that you're walking the way God wants you to walk. You're living the way God wants you to live. Hallelujah. And you're pleasing the Lord in everything you do. Glory to God. I believe that this is a forgotten, forgotten uh, uh, item uh, uh, in Christendom today. Praise God. This is something that we forget, hallelujah, that we are saved, hallelujah to God, and that we go on to a life of righteousness, a lifestyle of righteousness. Now, I'm not talking about self-righteousness. You can do things, glory to God, that are good, hallelujah to God, and exalt yourself in your self-righteousness. I'll be honest with you, self-righteousness stinks in the nostrils of God. Hallelujah to God. The Bible said that all of our righteousness is as filthy rags. Glory to God. But you know, I want the righteousness of God. Praise God. And the Bible says that we are the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah to God. No other way, no other form. Hallelujah to God, but only in Christ Jesus. Jesus, praise the name of God, hallelujah to God. In our last session, we talked about hungering and thirsting after righteousness, hallelujah. Glory to God, are you hungry enough to want righteousness? Are you thirsty enough? Your soul is dry and thirsting, hallelujah to God, for righteousness, praise the name of God, hallelujah. And we got to come to that point to where we desire more of the righteousness the right wiseness of God in our life. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah to God. I want to go today to a, another scripture, praise God, that is familiar to us. Praise God. Hallelujah. Again, out of Matthew, praise God. Uh, uh, chapter 6, verse 33, glory to God, that says this. But seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all these things shall be added unto you. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and, and uh, his righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. Glory to God. We find in this world today, praise God, and particularly in the church, glory, that people are so materialistic, so materialistic, they want a blessing of this, a blessing of that. They want a, they want a better job or they want a better, they want a house or they want uh, to ride in the finest car. Praise God. Hallelujah to God. Uh, uh, you know, uh, glory to God. And they seek after and they work and folk work hard for these things. And you should work hard. I'm not saying don't work hard. Praise the name and do what you know to do. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah to God. But praise God. Don't base our life. Hallelujah, on just getting those things. When you do, hallelujah to God, you're going to find yourself uh, experiencing more disappointment than victories. And we want to have victory in our life. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. When you put your heart and your, and your mind and your thought solely on those things, hallelujah to God, you may attain them, but you won't be happy in it. You may attain them, glory to God, but they'll still leave you wanting. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah to God. The word of God says, but seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. Hallelujah to God. Praise the name of God. Seek first the kingdom of God. Hallelujah. And his righteousness because, hallelujah, it sets a foundation for all other things to abide. Praise the name of God. It sets the foundation for our joy and our peace. Hallelujah to God. Our happiness. Glory to God. It sets the foundation for our walk. It sets the foundation for our lifestyle. Praise the name of God. You know what? Hallelujah to God. I, I, I'm a hard worker. I'm, my wife tells me I'm a workaholic. Praise the name of Jesus. Glory to God. But it 
is important to me, praise God, that I work hard for getting, hallelujah, the righteousness of God working in my life and in in our life as a family. Praise God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Husbands uh, are failing their families because of a lack of the righteousness of God. Are you hearing me? Glory to God. Wives are failing their children because of a lack of the righteousness of God in their life. Praise the name of God. And we got to get back to the place that we seek his righteousness, that we want his righteousness. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah to God. We, when we get up in the morning, glory to God, have a mindset that I'm going to find out more about how God wants me to work and how God wants me to live. Praise God. I'm going to beef up my lifestyle, so to speak. Praise God. Uh, uh, after the heart of God, praise God, and be, hallelujah, uh, the Christian he wants me to be. Glory to God. Have the mindset, have the mind of Christ. Glory to God. Seek first to please God. Seek first to please God. God, what can I do to please you today? What can I do, God, hallelujah to God, that will touch your heart today? Praise God. Can I touch your heart in my praise? Can I touch your heart in my worship? Hallelujah. He wants you to touch him in your walk. Hallelujah to God. He wants you to touch him in such a way, praise God, from your spirit. Praise God. What comes from the heart reaches the heart, they used to say. Say, praise Jesus. Hallelujah. I want to, I want to be a, a more like Jesus. Oh, to be like Jesus. Oh, to be like him. That's all I want is to be like him. Praise the name of Jesus. Glory to God. What do you want? Hallelujah to God. Seek first the kingdom of God. You want blessings. You want blessings to flow in your life. Seek the kingdom of God. Seek his righteousness. We don't always do everything that is right. Praise the name of Jesus. We don't always do everything that is pleasing to God. Praise the name of Jesus. We don't always do everything, hallelujah to God, praise God, that will allow blessings to flow in our life. But God wants our life open, hallelujah, so that his blessings can flow. He's made provision for everything. Praise God. He has made provision for everything, hallelujah, that we need and that we even may desire. He did promise that he would give us the desires of our heart. But don't you know that there is a hindrance to us receiving those desires? It's when we do not live according to the will of God, when we do not live according to the way of God, or that way, uh, the way God wants us to live, it will hinder the blessings of God from flowing in your life. You got to tell yourself, stop, stop right there and find out, hallelujah, what I'm doing wrong. Find out what you are doing wrong, correct it so that God's blessings can continuing, continue to flow. I want his blessings to flow and not trickle. Oh, come on, somebody. I want his blessings to flow in my life and not trickle down, drip, 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 drip. Praise God. Hallelujah to God. He wants to pour you out a blessing that you do not have room enough to contain. Hallelujah to God. So I want to know how to do that. I want to be, hallelujah, have my mind and my heart open, hallelujah, to what God wants me to do. Praise God. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. Glory to God. And everything that man is clamoring for, everything that he may may think he need, everything that he may desire, hallelujah, the Bible says, shall be added. Praise the name of God. Glory to God. When you walk the way God wants you to walk, when you live the way God wants you to live, everything will be added. Praise the name of God. God will start blessing you with stuff you didn't even ask. Oh, come on, folk. Hallelujah to God. He'll start blessing your life. Praise God. Hallelujah. He'll start meeting every need you have. Just live. Hallelujah. Like he wants you to live. Take up the lifestyle of righteousness. Glory to God. Because it will begin to add value to your life. Praise God. It'll add value to your home. Praise God. It'll add value to your worship and your service. Praise the name of God. Glory to God. You'll become valuable to your employee. Hallelujah. An employer. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. You'll become valuable in every relationship you have if you live according to the way that God wants you to live. Praise the name of God. The Bible even indicates that our enemies will be at peace with us. 
Because we live a lifestyle of following Jesus and following in his footsteps. Praise God. He's already come. He's paved the way. Now we need to follow him. Praise God. In that way. Glory to God. So we can begin. Hallelujah. To reflect a firm relationship with Jesus Christ. Praise God the name of God, so that now all of his blessings and all of his things will begin to flow in our life. You see, we clamor and we scrape and we cry and we whine for things that God has already said he was going to do in our life. Praise God. And we're wondering why they are hindered because we forget. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. That God blesses us in righteousness. Are you hearing me? God blesses us in righteousness. Glory to God. Sin will hinder your blessing. Praise God. Glory to God. Sin will hinder God's favor in your life. Are you hearing me? Oh, I know people don't like to hear that. Praise God. But it's the truth. It's the truth. Praise God. We are instructed to lay aside. In other words, get rid of. Praise God. Get rid of every sin and every weight or everything. Hallelujah. That gets you off course. Hallelujah. You need to tell the devil, I am not going to get off course today. I am not going to get off course today. I'm going to stay on course. I'm going to stay with the Lord. I'm going to do what he wants me to do. I'm going to live right. I'm going to act right. I'm going to talk right. I'm going to be right. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. So that my life can be blessed and devil, you can no longer hinder my blessings. Hallelujah to God. Glory to God. Victory cannot be uh, evident in your life. Hallelujah. When you live the wrong way, praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Victory. Hallelujah. Should be hallelujah. A staple in your life. Bless the name of Jesus. Victory. Hallelujah to God should testify, glory to God, uh, that you are a child of God, hallelujah, that you walk after the ways of God, praise God, hallelujah. Folks should be able to look at you, hallelujah, and look at your lifestyle, hallelujah, say that's a man and a woman of God, praise the name of God. She's a woman of God, he's a man of God, hallelujah to God. They should, hallelujah to God. And the only way that can be evidenced is not by wearing a t-shirt that says I'm born again, glory to God, not having a bumper sticker on your car, hallelujah, says, say, I'm a king's kid, glory to God, and none of those things, they should be, they should be able to watch you and see how you live, bless the name of Jesus, hallelujah, when you seek the kingdom of God and you get a desire in your heart to say, this is what I want, this is how I'm going to live, praise God, for God I live and for God I die, Job, Job said, hallelujah to God, blessed be the name of the Lord, glory to God, what happened, praise God, God began to bless him, why, because he's, he got himself up from his mully grub bed of sickness, hallelujah to God, and he squared himself, hallelujah, in the face of the enemy, and said, for God I live, hallelujah to God, and for God I die, hallelujah, then God opened up the windows of heaven, and began to pour him out blessings, and blessed him, oh, immensely, now God is no respect of person, hallelujah, if he did it for Job, he'll certainly do it for you, praise God, but we got to get our life in line. Are you hearing me? Glory to God. We got to get our life in, my, in line. Praise God. With God and his way. And the only way to know his way is to know his word. And to get in his word. Hallelujah. And hear what the spirit of the Lord instructs us. Out of his word. Hear what the spirit of the Lord is saying to you today. Praise God that there is more for you than you realize. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Find out my way. He says, follow Christ. Hallelujah to God. Follow Christ. You may have to deny a lot of things in your life, but follow after righteousness. Praise the name of Jesus. It may separate you, praise Jesus, from friends and family, but follow after righteousness. Glory to God. You may be talked about, glory to God, and have your name rumored up and down the highway, but follow after 
Christ. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. You make up your mind and in your heart that you will do so. Glory to God. I guarantee you, God will begin to bless you. He'll begin to heal your body. He'll begin to touch your children. Praise the name of Jesus. He'll begin to do things for you. Praise God that you thought he has forgotten about. Bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. Hallelujah. Follow after righteousness. Follow after righteousness. Hallelujah to God. Glory to God. And you begin to add things. Hallelujah to your life. When things are added, hallelujah to God. Sometimes you, uh, uh, you were not, ex sometimes those things, some of those things were not what you expected, but he's adding them. Hallelujah. And they become a benefit to your life. God adds what becomes a benefit to your life. He doesn't add things that take away from your life, but that becomes a benefit to your life. Hallelujah. He said all these things that you may have worried over. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Shall be added to you. Praise God. I want his goodness to be added. Don't you want his goodness to be added? Hallelujah to God. Don't you want to be able, hallelujah to God, to have the goodness of God added to your life every day that you live? Glory to God. Follow after righteousness. Hallelujah. Seek first the kingdom of God. Hallelujah. Why must I find the kingdom of God? Hallelujah. Because we lost it in the garden. Praise God. Hallelujah to God. We lost it when Adam and Eve fell. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Now that we are saved and born again, hallelujah, we can find it again. Praise God. Find it. Glory to God. The Bible says, seek and ye shall find. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Looking for the kingdom of God. Looking for his righteousness. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And you will find it. Bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. And when we find the kingdom of God, we'll find righteousness. And when we find righteousness, we'll find the kingdom of God. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. You see here, hallelujah to God. The righteousness of God, the kingdom of, all, of God comes together. Glory to God. It is mentioned together because this is meant to be perceived together. Hallelujah to God. Glory to God. You want the kingdom of God in your life? The kingdom of God is at hand and the righteousness of God comes with it. Then who, what are we talking about? We're talking about Jesus Christ. Praise God and him crucified. Bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. He brings a fullness into our life. Glory to God that in otherwise we would live without God wants you to live a full life. Praise the name of Jesus. He wants you to live, hallelujah, a life of dynamic joy. Are you hearing me? Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. Glory to God. He takes the worry factor out. Hallelujah to God. No more worrying, glory to God, about, you know, uh, 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 God doing some things. We don't have to worry over it. Hallelujah. We can have faith that God is going to do it are you hearing me that God is going to work like he said he would for us and for our half seeking righteousness because <laughs> hallelujah the more and more read and more and more we talk about this we're finding hallelujah the value in it praise God for a lot for a long time we've been living a valueless life for a lack of his righteousness in our life. Now, I know that we're the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus, but that doesn't mean we don't do anything. That doesn't mean that we don't look for, hallelujah to God, the righteousness, hallelujah to God. God, he wouldn't have told you to seek something you can't find, glory to God. So when you find it, you can become it, hallelujah to God forevermore. But he speaks, praise the name of God, of what we shall be. When we find it, we become the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. Are you hearing me? Hallelujah to God. And then if we are, we are because we found it. We are because we walk after it. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah to God. Hypocrisy doesn't make you the righteousness of God. Doesn't keep you the righteousness of God. We got to quit saying the thing and we got to start doing the thing. We got to quit saying the thing and start doing the thing. Praise 
the name of God. Enough hearers. We got tons of hearers. We got tons of hearers, but nobody's doing nothing. Nobody's doing nothing. Hallelujah. And then we wonder why we can't be blessed. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. We got to get back to the basics of the scripture. Hallelujah. Say, seek ye, and not just seek, but seek it first. Hallelujah. The kingdom of God and all of his righteousness. Hallelujah to God. Hallelujah. And everything will be added unto you. Don't you want God adding some things to your life? Do you want God, hallelujah, to make your life fulfilled? <laughs> Praise the name of God. I know you do. Praise God. Well, my time is gone. Glory to God for this session. Glory to God. But I want to encourage you to be back with us next time for another edition of the Abiding Word. God bless you. We'll see you again. Christmas will be here before you know it, and nothing beats the gift of music. Our seasonal CD, A Very Special Christmas, will keep the spirit of the season alive and bring joy to your heart. Get your copy today by going to www.dudleysmith.net and clicking the Ministry Bookstore tab to make your purchase. Dudley's renditions of these endless classics will make the season bright. Order your CD today. We have your copy waiting for you so you can have a very special Christmas. The Lord is doing some wonderful things through this ministry and we are expanding in our reach in gospel works. We are getting more and more invitations to do crusades on foreign soil. Additional opportunities to expand our TV broadcasts have come to our door. Plus, we desire to feed more hungry families through our Feed Hungry America campaign. We're asking you to help meet the needs of this ministry by giving a gift of $10, $20, $50, or even $100. We know there are many ministries and charities vying for your donor dollars, but if you believe in us and the gospel we preach, please consider becoming a partner donor with us. We would honestly appreciate your help. Go to our website at www.dudleysmith.net and click the Partner Giving tab in our bookstore to send your donation today. It is safe, quick, and all gifts are tax deductible. We sincerely thank you for your giving and know that God will bless you richly for doing so. May you always prosper and be in good health. Amen. Well, we've reached the end of today's program, but we hope that you were blessed by the word of the Lord today. Praise the name of God. I'd like to take a moment and pray with you right now. Hallelujah. Let's believe God for a miracle just for you. Father, in the, in the name of Jesus, God, Lord, we come to your throne room boldly to make our petitions known, God. Lord, I ask, Lord, your healing virtue touch, Lord, that individual that needs healing. Somebody has a malady in their body and needs healing from you, God. Touch them right now, Father. Somebody needs deliverance, Father. Bring a breakthrough by your Holy Spirit power in the name of of Jesus Christ, God. And we thank you for performing miracles in the life of your people. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Praise God. I thank you once again for joining us for today's program. And we like to know if this program has been a blessing to you in any way. Why don't you take a moment and write us or contact us through our email at DudleySmith at BellSouth.net. That's DudleySmith at BellSouth.net. Now remember this that any of our books or music that is advertised on this program can be purchased from our website at www.dudleysmith.net. Praise the name of God. I look forward to seeing you again for another edition of The Abiding Word. May God bless you is our continued prayer.
Thank you for watching the DSM Broadcasting Network.